aesthetic. Not aesthetic. And by clean, I really just mean put everything behind the camera so you can't see it. I didn't have time to make breakfast, so I'm gonna just kind of pretend that I did. Why are you doing that? Showcase talent and the joy it brings her. Hey guys, I tried to create an aesthetic video with the help of AI. I told AI my mission and what I'm about, like leading with the light, joy in motherhood, faith, and intentional living. Then I told AI to create a storyboard for a five minute aesthetic video. It gave some interesting things, some more realistic than others. I tried to follow what I could, but I also tried hard to create a good video. Stick around to see the behind the scenes of how I filmed it. Without further ado, here's what AI calls a day in harmony, nurturing faith and family with Natalie Morrell.
think of it down in the comments. As you'll see in the behind the scenes, there are some things that work and some things that didn't work. Here's how I filmed it. All right, it's 6.30 a.m. I just woke up and I'm letting AI direct my video for the day. I wanna kinda sorta take it seriously. I wanna try and get it close just to see what it would be like. There are some things that are just completely unrealistic, so I'll have to figure out what to do about that. The first thing it says is a soft sunrise with birds chirping. Well, all the birds kind of flew south for the winter. It's still pretty dark out there. The next thing it says, Natalie wakes up and smiles at her family sleeping peacefully. Well, we sleep with the baby in our room and she's already awake, which is why I'm awake. She wakes up in the mornings to eat and so she's not sleeping peacefully right now. The other side note is it's too dark in the room and that's also why I'm not filming my room right now because we have the sound machine on and it's still really dark in there. That's not based in reality. I think what we're gonna see throughout the day is what we see as the typical aesthetic, especially for moms, is not real. It's not based in reality at all, but we're gonna try. We're gonna try to see how much of an effort it takes to have a seamlessly effortless video. Oh, the other thing is, is I just woke up, but I have to look like I didn't just wake up. So I'm gonna go do my hair and I'm gonna go get dressed and then pretend to wake up from there. You know how it is in the movies when people wake up and they have the hair done, their makeup on, all that stuff? Yeah. Hey, let me get a uh, light so you can see me. <clears throat> Yikes. Can you pretend to sleep peacefully? Also, she's wearing like normal baby clothes, a lot of pink, a lot of prints. Uh, is that gonna be a problem for my aesthetic? This is reality. <clears throat> that sound machine is real loud. All right, in order to catch that aesthetic shot, I'm gonna have to turn off the sound machine. I'm gonna have to put some lights on in here so we can actually see. Now I gotta film myself waking up, so I'm gonna run, grab my tripod so I can put my camera down. Um, but then I'm also gonna do my hair. <laughs> I wanna pop on over to my other kids' room to see, are they sleeping? And see if I can get some shots of them. It's too dark to realistically film, so I have to go. I'll be right back in. Um, it's too dark, so I'm gonna go get a nightlight and get some light. Pretend to sleep, Gideon. <laughs> Can you look at the nightlight, Matilda? So now I'm gonna try and get the sunrise. Starting. Now I'm actually gonna get dressed this time. All right, because I was doing the filming, my husband made it breakfast because I don't have time to do it all. The next thing to do is prepare a healthy breakfast for my family, and then capture joyful moments of family breakfast and prayer, and then positive, uplifting background music. Well, the music that we listen to is slugs and bugs sometimes, but that's copyright, so I'm not gonna be playing that. I didn't have time to make breakfast, so I'm gonna just kind of pretend that I did. <laughs> and commandeer my husband's work. But they're already like halfway through eating. <laughs> Not realistic at all. All right, Gideon, you gotta come over here and look joyful. Can I see? Let me see your cute little lips full of blueberries. <laughs> Can I see? You need your best joyful face. Oh. <laughs> all right, now that it's a little brighter out, I'm going to film myself waking up. I ate blueberries for breakfast. First I gotta make my bed. Focus. I got the shot. Took 10 minutes to get a maybe two to three second clip. All right, now it's time to go drop my son off at school. All right, we have moved on to the work and play scene. So I need to get a shot of me working from home, balancing work tasks, uh, sneak peeks into my creative workspace, and intercut with playful moments with my children. Right now, I'm actually truly working. I'm doing some stuff in Canva and some posting on social media. My husband's also in here doing some planning right now and 
We have a little Miss Matilda there. Astrid is sleeping right now. Nap time is generally prime work time. The office right now is a bit of a mess. I haven't cleaned up since, oh wow have a half finished puzzle right here and all the baby stuff right here and we're kind of in the midst of transitioning things around so that we can um fit two desks in here um but then we also have a third that has to go out first things first i gotta go actually clean my workspace so that it looks aesthetic. and by clean i really just mean put everything behind the camera so you can't see it Come sit in my chair. Button, you go there and I'm gonna spin you, okay? Alright, well we're not gonna actually click any buttons, okay? Can you get a shot of like from here? So in order for me to get a shot of me filming and scrolling on social media, I have this set up here. It says scrolls through Instagram and Facebook discovers and engages with positive faith-based content and shares a meaningful post with her online community. Um, okay. That takes a lot of work to think of a meaningful post. Hey, AI, write a meaningful post for my online community. Let's see what I can pull together. All right, kids are down for their afternoon nap. I just had a quick bite to eat, and now I'm gonna keep on filming the other stuff. What's coming up now is, um, the aesthetic Bible reading and reflection and journaling. And so I'm gonna try and set that up. No, I don't do this every day. I try and read my Bible every day, but I do not do it aesthetically like this every day. Everything that I cleaned out of my office, I just stuck right here. So I have to clean this out so that this can be my aesthetic chair. This is the part that you don't see. Okay, I have my Bible and aesthetic notebook and also some journaling pens. I'm gonna set up the camera on a tripod. I'm gonna go find a candle. Also get a cup of hot tea. It says calming music, but also copyright. So I'll just overlay the music in the actual video. Here's my aesthetic corner. This is the non-aesthetic corner. <laughs> aesthetic, non-aesthetic. Not real life, real life. <laughs> but this is also real life too, because sometimes this does happen, just not every day. I have it nice and zoomed in, nice and comfortable. Let's focus right here. I gotta make sure that these are actually in the shot, because what's the point of having them if they're not in the shot? And the baby just woke up. To get some more aesthetic shots, I had to put the camera all the way down there. I'm gonna try and get one of a cool angle. Next on my list is a nature connection scene, which is a little difficult. Frigid outside right now. Like we're in a wind chill advisory, so it's freezing cold. So I will not be going outside. Last week, we went out as a family and we did, uh, we played in the snow, did a little walk around. Um, so I will be inserting clips of that. And also the baby's already awake because it's been 40 minutes and she just sleeps in 40 minute cycles. Hi, you decide you didn't want to nap? Oh, and then creative expression. I think I'll try and do that before Matilda wakes up. Engage in a creative activity, perhaps art or writing. Showcase talent and the joy it brings her. Encourages others to pursue their creative passion. Um, I'm not a super artsy person. My mom is an artist, but I sadly did not get that gene. At least not when it comes to drawing. Maybe I'll print something off and color it in or something. So I am attempting to do some art, some doodling. Um, my preferred form of creativity is not art. Um, I personally consider video editing as creativity and I love that, but AI said to go with um, writing or art. As I pulled up uh, bullet journal ideas on Pinterest, I'm just following a little tutorial. And so I have my camera here filming it and here is, Here's where I'm doing the drawing, and then there's my little tutorial right there. Hi, Astrid. We're gonna draw some plants. <coughs> Just copied them from there. <laughs> Is that funny? AI says that I'm supposed to encourage people to uh, create. I think I'm gonna skip that part. So I just filmed what I think is the last one 
um, I was going to do like a little fika of us um, after getting at home from school just because uh, we're going somewhere and I will not be able to do a cozy dinner as um, AI said to do. Oh, I think that's it. It was kind of a lot of work, okay? This is why I don't do these aesthetic videos all the time. Or ever. It's not based in reality. They're really fun to watch. I mean, I really enjoy seeing them. I really enjoy um, just the aesthetics. I enjoy that it's pretty. I enjoy beauty. In reality, with kids, it doesn't quite work so well. You have a short amount of time when you're able to do something. Everything's not always photo ready. And that's okay because that would drive me crazy if we had to live our lives photo ready all the time. AI takes the average of what's out there on the internet and then it gives it to you saying like this is the way that it's done. So that means that kind of aesthetic is the average. I'm here to show you that that's a lot of work. It's fun. It's pretty, but it's not real. Sorry. It's real in the sense that I was able to accomplish it, but it's not reality. All of these things are things that I do ish but not on a daily basis and not to that extent so when you are watching those aesthetic videos just know that it's not that's not how people live their lives every day because i think the danger is is that we can compare our everyday life to that and we're like oh man our lives aren't like that um but their lives aren't like that either and maybe it maybe it is but today was was a little bit of an effort. I had fun, I enjoyed it, and I'm just glad that I don't have to do that all the time. Let me know what you want to see next. I kind of want to try following AI's prompts exactly, no matter how ridiculous they are. That's all for now. Make sure you subscribe and turn on your notification bell. Give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye! Man, it's a full-time job being an aesthetic YouTuber. Now, close your eyes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Alright, you know you gotta give me a laugh, okay? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>